Good morning, guys. Today I kind of want to touch on a subject that is really important to me personally. And it's reprogramming my consciousness. Just for uh, conversation's sake. You know, when we're young, growing up, we're constantly influenced by good and bad things, okay? Whether or not we realize it and whether or not the influencers realize it, okay? So, for instance, growing up in a home where dad always said we can't pay the bills because we don't have money unbeknownst to him he is actively affirming that you live in poverty and you will stay in poverty okay and that's a big deal you want to put out positive affirmations. I enjoy positive affirmations. No matter what the situation, you have to put out positive affirmations. This is part of the process of reprogramming your mind, okay? See, your mental opinion is influenced and not only from out external sources, but from the internal. You can help influence and program your mind by putting out positive affirmations, by accepting that you are better, that life is better, okay? By design, our subconscious mind accepts negative situation as fact. The reason being is because it's the safest place to be. Okay? It's hard to get up in the morning to go to work. It's safer subconsciously if you lay in bed and sleep and get rest. Okay? Now obviously in the real world it's not safer to do that. You got to get up, you got bills to pay, you don't want to be leeching off the system. That's not cool. Now, some of the things that I personally do to help with my, um, to create or generate a more positive mental consciousness is when I'm going at night, I'll put on, on YouTube, Uh, You Are Creators is an awesome uh, YouTube channel. But I'll listen to them before I go to bed, like 15, 20 minutes before I pass out. And I'm just reprogramming my mind. As I'm starting to go to bed and I'm getting relaxed, my mind is learning positive affirmations. I am a winner. Good things are supposed to happen to me. I will overcome. I will be financially independent. I will be financially free. I do love myself. I love my family. I am powerful. All these obviously are positive things. Reiterating that to yourself through repetition. Repetition is how we learn. One of the ways. can help you start to create a belief system in your own mind. And if you're reprogramming yourself with positive things, you're creating a new belief that's going to bring on the emotion or the feeling of feeling better. And if you're feeling better, that's going to promote more positive behavior. Okay? A simple thing that I like to do in the morning, when I get up, I'm tired. You know, we're all human. We're all tired when we get up. 
But I'll lay in bed and I know I got to get up. I know I got to work out. Or I know I got to go to work. Or whatever it may be. And I'll lay in bed. If I'm not moving, I'm telling myself positive affirmations. I am a winner. I am getting up. I am going to do this today. I am going to get on my hustle. I am going to make this day my day. And it works. I mean, obviously, I got up this morning. And obviously, everyone does wake up at some point. But it's the fact of taking control of your life to do better and to have better. Have more. Something, some influencers that maybe can help you are listening to positive affirmations. People that I listen to, uh, a really good guy is Les Brown. He's always fun. He's really pumped up, a lot of energy. Another guy is Bob Proctor with the Proctor Gallagher Institute. He can really break it down to a science to understand the chemical reactions that are going on, the fact that everything around us is energy. And you're going to either be in a positive vibration or a negative vibration. This is, this is fact. This is fact. All molecules vibrate. I definitely would suggest checking him out. And for all you fans of The Secret out there, Bob Proctor was a part of making that happen. And he was on The Secret Movie. I hope this helps you. One last thing to think about. You know, the power of uh, using just your your own voice. Depending, you know, I have my personal religious beliefs. And I'm not here to tell anybody they should believe anything or not. I'm just here to talk and hope that you guys thumbs up. Or thumbs down, but comment below if you thumbs down. Let me know. If you don't like what I'm saying, tell me. But uh, what I was trying to say is that through religious understanding or a theological understanding, we are all part of the Creator. Okay? And if you look at the Bible, you know, the first thing that there was was the Word. God spoke. With us being a part of the Creator and being given the superhuman, godlike ability to create, we are creators. The fact that I'm in this vehicle right now is proof that we are creators. You look around, you see the roads. You look around, you see airplanes in the sky. We create. That's what we do. We're not. We're we're so much more than what I believe the majority of population are aware of. So, but going back to that, you know, in the beginning there was the word. The word is powerful. What you put out, what you say to yourself, the conversation in your mind, you need to make sure that it's positive stuff. Don't succumb to being negative. And and for those out there that are trying to make that change, that are like, you know what, I understand this. I know what you're talking about. I'm doing it. And uh, it's difficult sometimes. Yeah, it's going to be difficult because the majority of the world is negative. You know, when people talk about the one percenters and the 99 percenters and, you know, the majority of the world are sheep. It's just something you have to understand. And that's because it's the easiest thing to do. It's easy to fall in line. It's easy to be told what to do when you don't have to think. But I hope you're thinking. I'm thinking. Let's think together. Positive things. Positive influencers. If you're stressed out about the news all the time, stop watching it. The news will always be there. The world's still here. If you wake up, the world's still here. If anything does happen, it gets crazy, it blows up, aliens come, civil unrest, whatever it would be, then you deal with that when it comes. But for now, stay positive. Focus on the conversation that you're having with yourself. Influence yourself. Stand up for yourself.
No one else is going to do it. They're going to stand up for themselves. I hope you have a great day today. Smile, make new friends, like, share, subscribe, thumbs up. Thank you.